Uh, just note attack TLDR, uh, Binance recently penalized $4.3 billion by the US DOJ for money laundering and with its former uh, CEO Changpeng Zhao fined $50 million has appointed Richard Tang, uh, sort of the DCEO, but remains operational. Um, the exchange announced the removal of 10 BUSD trading pairs, including APT BUSD and AXS BUSD, effective November 24th. Uh, citing reasons like poor liquidity and trading volume, it plans to discontinue and support for the USD by early 2024. This follows a previous delisting of 15 Russian ruble trading pairs, possibly aligning with Binance's intention to exit its Russia business, recently agreeing to sell it to Comex and the world's largest cryptocurrency exchange, Binance has been in the spotlight lately agreeing to settle money wandering charges with the US DOJ and planning to pay a whopping 4.3 billion dollars penalty. On top of that, the former CEO Cheng Peng Zhao resigned from his position and is required to pay a 50 million dollar personal fine for failing to implement appropriate anti-money laundering procedures. Despite the turbulence, the company assured that business is not affected, appointing Richard Tang as the new boss of the exchange. While just a uh, day after the whole drama, Binance announced it will remove 10 spot trading pairs, including Aptbust, AXS Bust, Aikbust, uh, Pullout, and the uh, USTC team, Philbust, Gasbust. Uh, the amendments are scheduled uh, to go into effect on November 24th. Uh, the marketplace did not provide an exact reason for the delisting, saying it periodically reviews uh, trading pairs and removes some of them uh, due to poor liquidity and trading volume. It's worth noting that all of the removed are BUSD trading pairs, with Binance previously revealing it will discontinue support for the stablecoin at the beginning of 2024. The company has advised users to convert the BUSD holdings to other assets prior to February 2024. Last week, Binance removed additional 15 spot trading pairs, which were all tied to the Russian ruble. Some of those included ADA RUB, SOL RUB, ARP, and XRP RUB. One reason behind the organization's move could be its intention to completely cease deposits in the aforementioned fiat currency. Not long ago, the exchange entered into an agreement to sell the entirety of its Russia business to the crypto platform comics.